One of my clients was connecting an older CNC machine to a wireless network running Cisco Aeronet APs. It's a pretty typical scenario for users and providers of advanced CAD and CNC software, where the software needs to communicate over the network to each machine. At this location, he found out that their machines weren't able to maintain a stable wireless connection and had trouble figuring out why. He gave us a ring and I ran through our standard troubleshooting procedure, looking through his configuration files, network topology, IP scheme, and diagnostic logs. Next, I tried to duplicate the issue in our lab, working with very similar equipment and still couldn't find anything. Could it be the Mports configuration? Maybe the maybe a configuration of the Cisco APs. The breakthrough came when we tested our older wireless imports directly in my client's actual production environment. As it turned out, the older imports did not have the connection issues. The easy fix would be to roll back onto the older firmware. And with Moxa, this is pretty easy to do. I was fortunate enough to get additional support from our R&D team, and they were able to conduct the remote session to learn more about my client's environment and develop a firmware patch that works specifically for them. This was a pretty challenging case, and I learned a few things. Sometimes there's no substitute for testing in an actual production environment, no matter what's on paper or how it tests in the lab. There may be a unique quirk in a user's environment or situation that causes unexpected behavior. I'm grateful to have a great team to back me up, so I was able to help my client in this case. I hope you found this helpful. Thanks for watching.